was about to be announced, right? He was like, um, actually, I, I met him when it, he did some stuff for me from when I got married two years ago, and I love um, I love the way that he makes the stuff, and Chris as well, because it's like they give you this. Uh, it's very classic, but they understand, you know, the modern edge and those sort of things, and yeah, that's what I like about it. I don't really know because I was only invited to this show. I mean, I just came to support Richard because I like his stuff. I don't know about Brit British menswear in general. I mean, I'm sure if you name some of the designers, I would know them, but I don't want to pretend that I know something that I don't. And um, as, a, as a musician, as a producer, I mean, uh, I was talking about the, the comeback of disco and everything like that. Do you think that um, that that's the case that uh, electronic is mainstream? Uh, well, I think like. Daft Punk just did a really clever thing and they showed everyone like a, a, a bit of a masterclass in how it's done in musicianship and I think it's healthy for music, you know, to have, it's definitely the anti to, you know, very computerized music, but they both have a place and I love them both, you know, I'm a huge fan of live musicianship and I've tried to bring that to all my records, but I also love, you know, Blip, Electronica and Grime and things like Darky Freaker, so I think they, you know, they're all, it's just about being innovative and not doing the same shit that everyone else is doing. But that's more important than like what technology or what tempo or what genre of music you're doing. Um, yeah, there's there's a lot. Uh, there's a, a bunch of rappers out of the states like Action Bronson and Danny Brown. I love. Um, Chance the Rapper, this rapper out of Chicago, producers out of England like Darky Freaka, and, you know, there's, it's like really exciting time for music right now. Thank you.